For this nail look, I'll be using graffiti decals. Here are the graffiti decals that I'm going to use. I bought three sheets from moonsugardecals.com. I find the images I want to use and I cut them out. Next I fill a cup with water and I place the decal on the cup and I let it soak for about 20 seconds. The decal will start to curl up on the sides and that's when you know it's ready to take out. I put the decal on a stamper so I can fill it in with white acrylic paint. Now you're probably thinking why is she using acrylic paint instead of nail polish? Well if you apply nail polish to the back of the decal it will cause the decal to curl up and sort of melt. I try to keep the acrylic paint thin so it won't take too long to dry. While I wait for the acrylic paint to dry, I start painting my nails. I apply a dark red polish to all of my nails. This is OPI Infinite Shine, can't be beat. The image plate I'm using is Finger Angel V05. This white polish is from Madame Glam called Snow White and I'm using my favorite nail stamper from Creative Shop. Once the image is dried on the stamper, I apply top coat and let it dry. Once the polish is fully dried, I lightly dab on non-acetone polish remover to stick on the decal. I pull off the decal and place it on top of my nail. I like to use a makeup sponge to press the decal down. Some people like to use top coat to stick on a stamping decal, but I found that the top coat either dries too fast or smears the decal. I like using this method because the remover makes the nail polish slightly sticky and adheres the decal perfectly. I cut away the excess and clean up with acetone and a flat brush. Next, I wet the top of the stamping decal with non-acetone polish remover and I place the graffiti decals. I repeat this on all of my nails. You can use one full graffiti decal or you can do it like I did and cut the decals in half and mix and match them on each nail. I cut off the sides of the decal that hang off of the side of my nail.
After I have placed all of the graffiti decals and cleaned up, I apply a fast drying top coat. Once the top coat dried, I decided to make these nails matte, so I applied SE Mad About You Matte Top Coat. 